So this is a little uh, miniature belt grinder that I'm making. It's actually uh, uh, going to use this belt, which is a uh, half inch by 12 inch. Uh, making it small on purpose so that it can be used for delicate work. This is a small, uh, I think it's a 775 uh, DC motor, 13,000 RPM. And I've got a half inch pulley mounted on there that's uh, just basically made from a piece of steel rod. This is a piece of aluminum U-channel. And then this is a uh, 3 8 inch uh, steel rod that's fastened on there with a screw. Uh, here I've got a spring. And then this is a piece of uh, half inch uh, square tubing that uh, you can see on the bottom here, I cut off about an inch, I cut three sides off of about an inch, then bent the other side out. This will be used for tracking. Uh, this is a ball bearing. Uh, it's a half inch OD by a quarter inch ID. And then there's a piece of a quarter inch steel rod going through the center to hold it on there. This is a screw that goes all the way through that this spring can butt up against uh, for the tensioning adjustment. So the way this goes together basically is like this. The spring goes in the tube. Then this goes over the rod like that. And then the belt goes on here. There's a couple of uh, you can, there's a couple of slots you see that I've cut in the U channel here for the belt to ride in, and then this uh, comes up like this. And you just squeeze that down and slide the slide the belt over it like that. And then uh, when you want to run it, I've got it plugged into a 12 volt DC power supply back here. So uh, get it spinning. And then to, for the tracking, you just uh, move this lever up or down and that changes the tracking. Now I'll be uh, hooking uh, some kind of an actuator rod to that and running it out to the side with a screw adjustment on it so I can uh, keep it in one location pretty easily. But you can see it uh, spins up to a pretty good speed. And that's probably 12 volts going into it right there. So this will be good for uh, doing small uh, intricate work and as you can see you can slide uh, you can uh, basically sand the inside of a square or round opening by just sliding it down over the belt like that. So anyway this is where I'm at with it so far. Uh, more on it later when I uh, get it finished.